everybody, it's Kristen or VSG Hard on My Sleeve and I am coming to you with a video about advice for newbies. Um, I get a lot of questions and comments from people that are new, that are having surgery soon, um, that are waiting for insurance approval or, you know, whatever the case may be. Sorry, is this dark? Let me... Okay, my hair looks really dark, but anyway. So, newbies, my advice is you have to get obsessed. You have to get a little obsessed about, um, well, sorry, I have notes that I wrote down here, um, about the topic in general, about the surgeries that are out there, um, you know, about the doctors in your area, what can go wrong, what will go right, what your um, insurance company covers. So, I mean, get obsessed, get informed, get information from YouTube, from forums, from from doctor's offices, from your primary care doctor. Go to informational seminars from surgeons. That's what I did. That's how I picked my doctor. Um, you know, get all the information that you can find. Obesityhelp.com, um, Facebook, anything and get obsessed about getting the information. Um, another really important piece of advice for newbies, call your insurance company. Before you do anything, call your insurance company. Ask them what are their requirements, is there a BMI, are there comorbidities, what doctors are covered, uh, I mean, you know, who, who will they cover, who's within your network or whatever the case may be. Um, the insurance is such an important, unfortunately, part of this process. So get informed by talking to your insurance company. Don't be embarrassed to call them and say, bariatric surgery, I know I was. They don't care, you're one of millions of people. Just call them, find out what you need to know. Um, talk to veterans, watch veterans YouTube videos. That helped me so much to learn and to get comfortable and to dream about where I could go. Um, I think it's really important. Also, um, I talked about the obesity help forum. If you have a nutritionist, talk to them. If you don't, talk, see if your, your potential surgeon's office has one and talk to them about how they work with clients. For me, it was really important to go to the seminar. It was an informational free seminar that my surgeon put on. Um, if you're in Colorado, his name is Dr. Shea. It's C-H-A-E, and he's out of Sky Ridge. He's actually the medical director there. Um, but anyway, go to the seminar from the surgeon. Usually a nurse or the nutritionist or a psychologist or the surgeon or all of them will be there. Talk to them and find out what their program is like. Um, who else can you talk to? So psychologists, if you have a therapist, a psychiatrist, whatever, a counselor, talk to them about it. Um, if you have a personal trainer at the gym, talk to them about it. Chances are they might have a client who has been through it that they can tell you, you know, what to expect or how successful this person was. Um, and if not, let them know anyway because your training program is going to change. Um, the main thing is just talk, talk, talk about it. Think about it. The more you process it, the more information you have, the more comfortable you're going to be. You're still going to have the fears we all do. It's totally normal, but it's going to be a lot um, less fears and a lot more rationalization if you have the information to back up your decision. So, um, you know, get the information and then sit on it. And chances are your insurance is going to require at least three months of appointments, if not six months. Um, prior to surgery. So you'll have the time to process it. Uh, and then, you know, the other important piece of advice, the final thing is surround yourself with a support system, whether it's your spouse or your friends or your boyfriend or your girlfriend or your wife or your husband, your parents, your sister, um, you know, find a support system. Reach out on YouTube and Facebook. It's been amazing for me and so many other people. Uh, that's why I continue to make videos because I need the support and I like to give the support. Um, and go to support groups, look in your newspaper or your phone book, talk to your doctor or your primary care, your surgeon, there's support groups out there, you just have to find them. I've been lucky enough to have the Colorado Rockette girls um, that are local in my area who I 
met through YouTube. Uh, you just never know, but support is crucial and priceless in this journey. So sorry this video is so dark, but um, that is it. So advice for newbies. I hope this helps and best of luck to all of you.